almost finished. Then I can turn in for the afternoon and get a nice cup of tea. Oh, oh my goodness. Hey there, little fella. Oh, you don't look too happy. Hey, it's alright. I won't hurt you. Oh, where did you come from? Where's the rest of your family, little guy? There was that big storm last night. You must have gotten separated. Oh, it looks like you got hurt pretty badly. You're looking pretty rough. And I wonder when the last time that you've eaten or drank was. Hmm. Stay right here. I'll be right back, little buddy. Here. You're gonna need something nutritious in you. I'm not sure how long you've been here. So even if you've already eaten, I'd rather not take the chance. Come on. It's okay. I'm a friend. Uh, hey. Got some nummies for ya. You gotta get something to eat. I'm sure you're really hungry, aren't you? Come on. They're nice and fresh. I promise. Grew them myself, even. What's going on with your head? Looks like you have quite the gash there. We'll have to get that cleaned up. I'd hate to see you get sick with an infection. Hmm. Oh. I could have sworn I had some in my bath. Let me check some more. <sighs> Rats. I'll have to get my medical kit back in the barn. Just so we can get you cleaned up. I'll leave these greens here for you to eat, so eat up, okay? Alright, little guy. I got you some fresh water and some medical supplies. We'll have you looking good as new in no time. I just need you to trust me. Will you let me pet you? There you go. I'm not gonna hurt you. You're alright. I'm gonna help you as best as I can, okay? There, there. That wasn't so bad, was it? It's nice that you're warming up to me now. But we really gotta take a good look at these wounds. I'd hate for it to worsen your fragile state. Let me get a closer look. Looks like it isn't too deep. 
so that's good. It's a bit too big to just ignore, though. So, I'll just have to get it cleaned really well. We should start by at least getting some clean water on it, and wiping away some of this debris. Oh. I'll take good care of you, little buddy. Don't worry. I think to start, I'm gonna try and brush away all of the big debris. On all of the areas around and on your wound. Don't worry, I'll be really gentle. And then I'll just go ahead and use some tweezers to get any of the little remnants that are left behind. Go ahead and use a damp cloth as well to just wipe away and kind of sanitize all of the wounded areas on you now. Doing so good. So, so well. And I just want to make sure that you are going to be as healthy as possible. There, there. Doing so well. Such an incredible little guy. that you've had a bit of a struggle when this happened. All of this debris has really ruffled your beautiful feathers. And it looks like this is the same gravel that's near the cliff a few miles beyond the forest. Is that where you're from? I guess I shouldn't have expected an answer, huh? <laughs> well, I'll just be grateful that you're being so nice for me right now. 
I'm sure this doesn't feel good at all. And I'll be sure to get you a nice treat once we're done. Alright? That's something my own ma would do for me whenever I got really hurt. After she would clean me up and brush me off, I'd get a tall glass of cold lemonade. <laughs> it helped lighten the mood. And I think the sugar in it urged me to get up and play some more. <laughs> Hopefully, you'll be just like me and recover really, really quick. I think you will. You've lasted this long without any help. You're a strong little guy. I know this might sting a little bit, but we have to get rid of any potential infection. looking much better. Some medicine and a couple of bandages should have you in a much better shape. I'll just have to mix something up quickly. Since it's not too serious, just a simple antibiotic should do the trick. I'll just need a little bit of this. And just a little smidgen of this. And then I like to add a little bit of aloe gel as well, so it isn't as runny. It's just a little bit more comfortable too, I think. You've been doing so good. We're almost done, I promise. I just need to get it covered and protected. Oh, now where did I put my bandages? Hmm. Ah, yes, here they are. <laughs> just stay nice and still for me. You know, <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a chocobo in a hat made of bandages before. <laughs> you just look so cute. <laughs> Nier, I'm sure you'll look even better once you're all healed. I'm 
might even be able to introduce you to the others here on the farm. You'd like that, right? Some friends to keep you company? Now, I'm not too sure where your family is now, but I'll do my best to welcome you here. For now, you're one of our own. Until you get better, I don't want you worrying about any little thing. You hear? <laughs> I'll take real good care of you. Come on up. Oh, who's the biggest bird? You're the biggest bird. Yes, you are. Such a big, brave fella. You're gonna get better and grow up to be so big and strong. But you have to get some rest first. You've had quite the day, haven't you? <laughs> oh, don't worry. I won't leave you alone. You're going to stay nice and warm, wrapped up in my arms. Snuggle on close. <laughs> You're gonna get better real soon. Oh, I just know it. <laughs> there, there. You're going to feel like a new bird by tomorrow. I'll get to introduce you to the rest of the farm, and you'll get to meet a bunch of new friends. You'll fit right in. I'm sure of it. <sighs> Until then, you need a good, long rest. So you stay curled up right here, and I'll make sure you stay nice, warm, and guys, this is Gentle GF. If you like this audio, make sure to give it a like and hit subscribe for weekly uploads. It helps give a little boost to YouTube's algorithm and greatly helps the channel. Thanks so much for watching and have a good rest.